Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. In today's video we're doing some autocross stuff with the V6 MR2. For those who have never watched any of my videos, this is my 93 MR2 that's been swapped with a J32A2, so it's a Honda V6 and it has an M90 blower on it and a six speed limited slip differential transmission. Normally going into an event, I have a goal because I always want to try to progress as a driver, but this time is a little bit different. I was feeling very arnery. I think that's a good way to put it. Well, let me just show you the driving clips because I think they really speak for themselves. I'm in trouble. You done goof. You done goof. At the end of that last clip, my buddy Jeff was actually giving me a hard time because one of the volunteers was actually gonna come over and talk to me because of my driving. The driving clips, I think, give you an idea that I was messing around, but I don't think they paint the full picture. I was really sliding the car around and just creating clouds of smoke. And that's why I ended up being talked to because the whole idea is car control, not drifting around, which I totally understand why they came and talked to me. And in hindsight, I should have been more respectful. So I did make sure to apologize and I toned it down. Well, normally there's stuff to talk about after every event, but this one was just different i mean it just it was just going out there having the thrill and i did exactly that it was it was a lot of fun it was something that i really really needed i guess if there is anything to take away from what i did don't be a hoon at an autocross event because they are about car control but the bigger picture is it's really hard to find venues so i understand that the stuff i was doing uh, is not the best because the venues can actually get a little a bit upset and uh, that's the last thing i want i don't want to be the reason why we lose a venue when it's already hard enough to find them well that's pretty much it for this video you probably won't see much of the v6 mr2 any time soon because she's pretty much going to lay dormant until I get the clutch. I actually am going to make some suspension changes. I did do one thing right at that event and I talked to people who were way faster and smarter than me, asked them some ideas, picked their brains. So I think I'll be able to uh, get the suspension set up and wheel tire set up and all that good stuff done right for next season. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.